More than a dozen members of the Hells Angels are being arraigned on criminal charges at the downtown courthouse. CBS 8's Kelly Hesedal joining us from downtown with what she has learned and seen in that courtroom so far. And that's right. You know, when I just got a copy of the indictment, we're talking about 17 defendants uh, who face criminal charges, including uh, charges of hate crimes as well as gang allegations. Uh, one defendant faces an attempted murder charge. Now, what this all stems from is an attack that happened uh, back in June in Ocean Beach against three African American men. I can tell you the courtroom is packed right now. Things were supposed to start getting underway at 10 a.m., but because there are so many defendants and many of them have private attorneys, it's taking a while for things to get sorted out. Out. But we do have video from inside the courtroom of some of those defendants uh, being formally charged. Uh, we also have video from the scene that night back on June 6 of what appeared to be a violent attack. According to police, three young men got into an argument with several bikers outside of a bar near Newport Avenue in Bacon. One man was stabbed in the chest. Another was knocked out. Now that night, police arrested one suspect. There was an investigation, and since then, the case ended up in the hands of a grand jury. In the end, they charged 17 people. A news conference just got started upstairs on the 13th floor of the Hall of Justice. Uh, we'll be hearing from the DA's office, as well as nearly a dozen other members of law enforcement, including the ATF, the San Diego Sheriff's Department, as well as San Diego Police, and several other police departments from this area, from Oceanside to Escondido, National City to Chula Vista. So this certainly appears to be a wide widespread investigation. And so we're going to head upstairs to listen in on this news conference. We will bring you an update on the four. Kelly Hessett, all CBS 8.